somehow it endures. We welcome you to Minister Engagement. Amen. Yes, we are back on this Holy Week Thursday. Amen. Mm -hmm. We're just up here, to, we're up here today to give God glory, mm -hmm. honor, and praise, to worship him in spirit and in truth. Mm -hmm. God, is a, God is a good God. He didn't have to send his whole only begotten son to die for our sin, for our transgressions. But thank God he did, because where would we be if, if Jesus mm -hmm. hadn't died on the cross, was buried in a barred tomb, and rose on the third day? Where would we be? I know I'd be still in my sins and transgression, but thank God for the blood that washed me, cleansed me, for, purified me from all my filthy ways, and set my feet on a higher plane to give him glory, honor, and praise yes. today. There's my head for a word of prayer. Father God, we just come before you this evening, this afternoon, Lord God, magnifying you. Move, uh, ask you to move on, on our behalf on today, oh God. Forgive us for our sins, our thoughts, our deeds, our actions, Lord God. In the name of Jesus, wash us, purify us, cleanse us, oh God. You have full control of, of these frail vessels on today, Lord God. As we come before you to worship you in spirit, and in truth, to praise you, oh God, for all the things you've done, all the things you're doing. And just because you are God and God alone, we just want to magnify you, want to glorify you this day that you have made, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Come on in, Holy Ghost, and just have your way. Permeate our very being even now. Take away any anxious, any anger, anything that's not like you, God. Take it out of us, oh God, purify us and replace, and replace it with more of you, oh God, more of your anointing, more of your power, more of your spirit, more of your grace, and more of your mercy, and especially more of your love on today. Hallelujah, yes. Everything that's been going on in this, in this world, in this nation, oh God, yes. we just lift it up before you even now, oh God. We just as the people that lost love, or they've lost their homes, lost their jobs, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, we just actually have mercy on them, oh, God, and cause them to realize that you are yet God, and you are yet in standing in control of this earth, and you just want us to repent, turn from our wicked ways, and lean and, and depend on you totally for yes. everything that concerns us, oh, God. In the name of Jesus, God, just have mercy on those who don't know you in the free part of their sins, and actually give them a mind to surrender their whole heart the whole lives, the whole everything to you, oh God, in the name of Jesus. We need you at such a time as this, Lord God. We need you in spirit and in truth. We need you, oh God. Help us to be honest with you as well as with ourselves, with, as well as with our loved ones, oh God, yes. in the name of Jesus. Yeah, you honor a righteous prayer. You honor, you honor those that are honest before your God, in the name of Jesus. And God, we just looked at ourselves, we looked at our family, our nations, our homes, our loved ones, everything that concerns us. We just lift it up before you as we go we come before you to worship you in spirit and in truth. In the master's name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and our Savior, we do pray. Amen. 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 I didn't hear you. I would say to God be all the glory. Amen. 
Amen. I turn into the hands of Pastor Money at this point. Amen. 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 Um, you can say I'm on location. I don't have my traditional equipment here and it doesn't work um, the same as the one to where I'm at home. But I thank God for mm -hmm. just blessing us still with the opportunity of having a technology to take it on the road. To God be all the glory. I give mm -hmm. honor to the Lord God who is in he the head of my life. I thank God for his mm -hmm. son, Jesus, that died on the cross that we can have the uh, opportunity to have everlasting life this is holy yes. as the woman of God says and so we dare not go any further in anything else in the week without giving God honor and glory and just coming before him to worship him today mm -hmm. God told me when the woman of God was praying is saying is that he loves us so much that in yeah. the word of God in Amos 3 7 he says that he doesn't let anything or uh, any of his things happen unless he reveals his secrets unto mm -hmm. the prophets of God until his, his people and I thank God because God has been giving us warning he's been yeah. giving us prophetic warning warning after warning and in February several times on Trinity Hour here on Ministerial Engagement and on Fourth Watch Prayer he gave Pacific dates in the month of March every single date that he gave mm -hmm. us, even down to March the 30th and the 31st, to where for the first time in history, a United States president was arrested on, on charges. But it wasn't just that. He said that in April, that people were going to be like, what in the world is going on? Mm -hmm. Day one of April, there were yeah. anywhere between 60 to 100 tornadoes that touched mm -hmm. down. In yeah. some cases, you had twin tornadoes. Mm -hmm. Probably the older Jeanette Little, she said it, and she heard God say it. And he said, told her that these tornadoes and these storms are spiritual. Mm -hmm. Yes. And I heard God say the same thing the other day, but she said it up here. She said it up mm -hmm. here on ministerial engagement. Mm -hmm. And now God is telling me to let the people know also that it's spiritual. So you've yeah. heard it from two women of God operating in the pro prophetic anointing of God. You've heard it from Apostle Davison also. And yeah. so God loves us that much oh hallelujah that he's given warning so he mm -hmm. to every single warning and as mm -hmm. today we're gonna come just like the woman mm -hmm. of god says and worshiping the lord god in spirit and in truth join mm -hmm. us because you always can pray people are mm -hmm. always praying but mm -hmm. are you doing enough praising god and thanking him are mm -hmm. you thanking him enough? Are you praising him? Are you worshiping him? Worship is needed and it's a needed thing. Yes. Everyone yes. should worship and not enough people are worshiping. And God led us today in starting off our holy week um, here on Ministerial Engagement is to start off with worship and praise. Mm -hmm. And so we do not own any rights to any of the music. However, we do ask that you include them into your music collection, your worship, praise, music collection. And so we're just getting ready to let go and let God share this with someone, yeah. share it with someone and, and, and let the people come in and worship the Lord God with us. May yeah. each one of you be blessed. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. This one is gone um, back old school. Oh, hallelujah. People get ready. There's a train of coming. You don't need no baggage. You just get on board. All you need is faith to hear the diesel's humming. You don't need no ticket. You just thank the Lord.
Hallelujah, hallelujah. People get ready. There is a train of coming. You don't need no tickets. personality flaws show us those characteristic characteristic traits god that are not of you god that lord god we will god oh yeah gotta see me 
repent. And Lord God, we will go forth in your will and your way, God. Lord oh, God, God, and search us if there's any unforgiveness, God. God. Lord, even unforgiveness in ourselves, God, help us to forgive ourselves, God. Lord, many times yes, we hold, Lord. Lord God, that unforgiveness, God. And Lord God, yeah. we don't want to do that, God. We don't want to hinder our praise. We don't want to hinder our worship. We don't want to hinder your being able to hear us, God. So yes. Lord God, forgive us and help us to forgive mm. ourselves, God. Lord God, create in us a clean heart and renew a right spirit within us, God. As we come, God, wanting more of you, Lord God. We surrender, God, our minds, our bodies, our souls unto you, Lord God. So, oh, yeah, God, let's see. So, Lord God, have your way on today, God. Watch, yes. purge, and create in us a clean heart and renew our right spirit in us. Renew our minds, God, in the name of Jesus. And have your way in our lives, God. Yes. Mm, yeah, yeah, see in Jesus' name, may your will be done. Amen. Oh, yeah, God, 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 yeah,
us, oh hallelujah, yes Lord, hallelujah, oh hallelujah, mm, hallelujah, thank you God. Give me you. Yes, God. Yes. surrender everything over unto the Lord God. Yes. Hallelujah. Just give everything unto him. Yes. Yes. Woman of God. Yes. I, I can I couldn't hear I couldn't hear the music. Yes, yes. It's gonna start playing you know, louder in a minute. Okay. That's just the beginning of it. Oh hallelujah. Amen. Amen. While while we're waiting on the music to play, I heard the Lord say, All of us, all of those of us who are self-righteous, judgmental, stop it. You cannot judge others when you're doing almost the same thing that they're, they're doing. Quit being so quick to judge others. Amen. If you're not in, if, if you're not in a body of believers and you're judging how they worship God, God says, stop it. Move through my hands, your thoughts stay on my mind, living me. Your song flow through my lips, your work move through my hands, your thoughts stay on my mind, living me. And you can have.
give you all of me. I'm yours. Can you lift that? You can have all of you. Sing, have all of me. Sing, have all of me. Tell them I'm yours. I give, I give you all of me. Give you all of me. Give you all of me. Now connect your heart with your mouth. You can have all. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. 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 Thank God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. While the song was playing, God was speaking. He says that in the word of God, it says, seek ye first the kingdom of heaven. And many don't seek God first. He was saying some don't even seek him last. You don't seek him at all. He yes, said God. that we're some are going to hear the song and they're going to sing, you know, God, you can have all of me. Mm, the check out of the song. Yeah. But he says there are some that don't even give them a crumb, not even a scrap mm. that you could leave for a dog. Come You're not giving him anything. But yet you say that you belong to him. He says that he's going to give them his all. And so we are supposed to put him first. Yeah. Jesus, thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus.
Gotta be where you are. Gotta be where you are. Come on, raise it before I'm sick. Gotta be where you are. Gotta be. a few minutes ago that I didn't say all of what he had given me. He said that the other part was is that we don't put ourselves in position to be able to hear and to be able to use to be able to be used by God for him to be able to pour out upon us. Um, Apostle, I yield to you in case God gave you something else to go along with that part. I'm trying to hear what he, I'm trying, I want to hear, hear exactly what he said. I'm asking him to repeat it. Amen. The song was playing. Amen. 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 Thank you, God. Amen. Amen. God says for us to totally yield ourselves to him today. Amen. Amen. If you want to experience him in his fullness today, total surrender is what we need. Amen. Amen. The oh, song, yeah, the song that's getting ready to play is never lost. And God ah. is saying that some of us have been lost and are lost right now that are going to hear this word also. Mm, I gotta deceive you. And and mm, he's still calling out for those that are gonna be tuning in later for yes. that repentance. Yeah. Mm, and that to come before him and worship because yes. it's not too late. Yes. Uh, I gotta see. And Apostle Precious, he says that you have it 
at this point regarding what it is that he's going to have you to do and to stay. And he says, walk in it. Oh, dear God, I, 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 walk in it, woman of God. Oh, yeah. hallelujah. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Yes. I walk in it. Walk in it. Oh, hallelujah. Yes. Miracles when you move. Yes. Such an easy thing for you to do. Your hand is moving right now. You are still showing up at the tomb of every life. Yes. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Man. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, <laughs> I never lost. Lost about. Yes. <laughs> Ain't nothing going to stop the word and the music and the move of God from coming forth in the name of Jesus. <laughs> surrender. Amen. God is calling for me in the life of him. I'm calling 
Hallelujah. 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 Amen. 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 Thank you, God. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. If you don't know the Lord God, this is a time that as we've been praising and worshiping the Lord God, that you can say yes to him. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Mm, hallelujah. Apostle Davidson, if you are able to do the altar call again. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Amen. Now is a, is a beautiful time. We've been worshiping, we've been praising God. And the last song was maybe God's been trying to tell you. Right now, God is pulling on you, God is speaking on you. And your Lord and your Savior. There's no long drawn out, drawn, long and drawn out process. All you have to believe in your heart and confess in your mouth that God already did on the third day. And he said, it's and believe in your heart that God raised you from the dead on the third day. It says over in Romans 10, verse 9, it said, You shall be saved. All you have to do is repent of your sins, ask God to forgive you of all your sins, turn from your ways, and turn to God's way. And you shall be saved. And all you have to do is say, Lord Jesus, I'm a sinner. I ask you to wash me, cleanse me, forgive me of all my sins, all my transgressions. Cleanse my mind, cleanse my heart, cleanse my spirit even now in the name of Jesus. You said over Romans 10 verse nine says, if, if I confess with my mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in my heart that God, you raised him from the dead, you said I shall be saved. For with a man, with the heart man believes unto righteousness with confession is made unto salvation. And I confess, that I was, that I'm a sinner, I need your salvation. And ask you to wash me, cleanse me, purify me from all filthiness, all unrighteousness, all dirt that's been in my heart from childhood on up in the name of Jesus. Father God, I just ask you to cleanse me, accept me as your own and sign my name in the Lamb's Book of Life in the name of Jesus. Father God, I've been a backslider. I walked away from your free love gift unto me. And I repent of my sins and ask you to forgive me and receive me back into your kingdom in the name of Jesus. Purify my heart, my mind once again in the name of Jesus. Resign my name in the Lamb's Book of Life. And this time I will stay in the shelter of your safety, in the shelter of your arms. And I thank you. I confess with my mouth and I believe in my heart that Jesus Christ is Lord and he is my Savior and my Redeemer from this time forth and forevermore in Jesus' matchless and mighty name. Amen. God has been speaking. I'm coming in a little closer because I want to make sure that everyone hears this. God has been speaking since before we came on, and he's been speaking since we've been up here. He told me something in the very beginning. For those that were here from the beginning to the end, the other, when, a couple of weeks ago, that when we did worship and praise, God said that he had a blessing there for all those that watched it and worshiped and praised God with us from beginning to end. God said in the beginning that he was still going to do that same blessing into him because as the praises and the worship went up, that God was going to allow the blessings to come down. But he gave me specific instructions to not to tell you until uh -huh. after we had finished everything and get ready to close. Oh, yeah, got my side. 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 For the faithful, for the faithful, for those that are dedicated, for those, oh, yeah, got my side. As Reverend Sakawa even preached, those that are committed. Yeah. Oh, yeah, got my side. Those that are committed to him. 
Yes. Not seeing, no one yet got to see this. Some of you and many people are going through a different level of spiritual warfare than you have ever went through and experienced before. Yeah. He says, for some, it's a press. For some, it's like the enemy trying to clog up your ears and to uh -huh. for spiritual deafness and spiritual blindness to where yeah. you can't hear and see. Oh, you got to see. But those that press through it, those that praise God through it, he says he's going to give you a boom that you got to see. I hear him saying a triple portion, triple portion for your faithfulness and for your press. So you got to say, he says that no weapons that Form, they shall not prosper Amen. and so we have to know and believe that all things are possible and we have to stand on the unadulterated word of god Amen. god seeing is that and he said earlier that there's been a spiritual shift there's been a spiritual shift we're going to see things that we haven't seen before we're going to see things that we haven't seen in a long time there's a lot of, lot of records that are going to be broken. There's going to be so much that is going to be happening that God is saying is that you're going to need him. You're going to need to hear and to yeah. see in the spirit. Yeah. And so that is what he was talking about when he was talking about crumbs and yeah. about you putting in and making God the head of your life. Yeah. That has to be the head of our life. Also, he said that in the book of Revelation, it's the only book with a promise and that we're to read and we're to study and we're to stay before him at all times, especially and a time in the season such as this. Yes, Lord Jesus. He says some of you don't have gloves. Mm, that's your God, that's not you. you don't have rubber gloves to put on your hands. He's been warning and he never stopped warning for people to stop wearing their gloves or their face masks. People in their disobedience have decided to go and do so. But mm. God hasn't released the people. He's still warning. And there is a new disease that's out, and there's one that's going to be coming. And you can mm. see it on the vegetation. He mm. says it's going to be by the touch, touching. He says this new fungus out. There's nothing to kill it, like the Lysol is not going to kill it, the hand sanitizers. And so when you have that pair of gloves that you've been out shopping, grocery shopping, you've been out working, you need to take those gloves off the proper way and discard it outside in a plastic bag, tied in something, so then that way other people cannot get access to it. There's mm -hmm. no known cure mm, that you got to see. God is saying to remember that it's going to be released from the air. Mm. It's going to go into the water. It's going to go into the soil. It's going to go into mm. the land and to plant your radishes and your ginger root. Oh, yeah, God, let us see here, this, here, that. So, yeah, God, let us see. Yay. Time after time. Oh, yeah, God, let see. Time after time. Oh, yeah, God, let see. The warning is coming forth. Oh, yeah, God, see. Who is listening? Oh, yeah, God, let us Yay. Those that are listening and receiving and doing. Oh, yeah, God, let see. You're going to have, you're going to be blessed. You're going to be protected. Oh, yeah, God, let us Yay. He says, hear this. The choice is yours. The choice is yours. However, God loves you so much that he, the only thing we were going to do is just worship the Lord. But as we worship him, like I said, he's been up here from the beginning. And even in worshiping him, just us wanting to worship him, he's still showing us love and kindness and still giving us a word of survival, a word to help us and our family and our loved ones. It's up to each one of us to receive what it is that God is saying. Do not allow anything to separate you from the Lord God. You're going to see the enemy comes in all type of ways. And just like right now, he's trying to mess with my voice because he does not want the people to go get this word. But it's going to come out. It's going to come out. Do you hear me? Because God's word is going to get out. But it's up to you. It's up to us. It's up to everyone, whether or not if they're going to receive God and his word. I yield to you, Apostle Davis, in the closest hour.
Amen. 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 But grow in grace and the knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. To him be glory both now and forever. Amen. 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 And we love you. Join us for Easter. Um, I call it for a Good Friday. Oh, hallelujah. Mm. We love you. I love you, woman of God. I love you. I'll be blessed and share the blessing, the worship and praise experience with others. We love you. Mm. Be blessed. Yeah. Glory. Amen. 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 To God be all the glory. Amen. 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 Thank you, God. I'm trying to close out what is going on. Um, thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Um, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Um, 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 thank you